Hey guys and welcome to another squad builder with me Monkerman and today I've got a little bit of a different team for you it's not really like a uh, Brazil team or like a international team or a league team or an actual team it's a more to do with stats this time I've got I have created the fastest team on ultimate team but the fastest team like uh, as well as good players so there are alternatives but ones that I feel uh, perform the best for me really that these are the ones I chose and I do have a few alternatives also All right, so I'm gonna start by going on my goalkeeper the goalkeeper doesn't really matter in the fastest team I guess you can just choose the one that you prefer uh, So for me, I chose Nur because he's like a pretty good keeper and quite cheap And uh, yeah, I, I I really like him. And he's played well for my team, but uh I don't really want to talk too much about Nur because he's not in the team, really. Well, he is in the team, but he's not, like, contributing to the fastness of this team. Um, so, I guess we go on to the right-back, then. So, uh, right-back, I got the uh, uh, Ignacio Abate, or whatever his name is. Uh, the right-back for uh, AC Milan, and he's Italian, so uh, he doesn't really pair up with anyone in my team as of yet. But, uh, yeah. He's really good. He's 93 pace. 79 dribbling, which is really good for a defender. Um, 77 passing, 75 heading, uh, 78 defending. So, like, an all-round stats. And he, uh, he's really good. Uh, good price. I got him for 9,900 coins. But uh, I think he goes for, like, around about 7 grand. So I overpaid a little bit because I wanted to get him really quickly because I was excited to get this team. Um, so on to my uh, centre-backs. Uh, my first centre-back is a Colombian centre-back, I think he is. And uh, yeah, he plays for Cruz Azul. And uh, his name is Pereira. Yeah, he's a 76 overall uh, rare silver. No, rare silver, rare gold. And uh 76 overall, not great, but uh, he's 82 pace. Uh, one of the fastest uh, defenders on the game. I think you could get, alternatively, uh, I think it's him, Day Day, and Thiago Silva. And uh, I don't think Thiago Silva's in my price range. And I got uh, Day Day for me subs, because I feel that Perea is a bit quicker. But uh, it's up to you who you prefer. I prefer Perea, surprisingly. And uh, so that's that's good for him. I got him for six hundred and fifty coins, by the way. Yeah, so pretty cheap for uh, for him. His shot, his shooting isn't great, thirty eight, but uh, you don't really expect shooting from a defender, do you? Uh, apart from heading, I guess. So uh, on to my second centre back. I got a uh, a player called Marvel Win. I think his name is. Uh, yeah, I think his name's Marvel Win or something. Um, uh, and he's a sixty six overall centre back. For Colorado Rapids uh, in the United States League, the Major League Soccer. And uh, yeah, he's pretty amazing. Yeah, he's got 93 pace. 93 pace, fastest centre back in the game. And uh, he's got. See, his stats don't really show how good he is. But because his like, pace is so good, it just like gets past any other uh, strike in the game, really. Because the only, there's only one striker I think that's quick about him, apart from the team of the week versions obviously. But uh, yeah, I got him for qu it was quite expensive, really for a silver. But because he's the uh, fastest centre back on the game, I guess it's a pretty good price. Uh, so yeah, I got him for seventeen thousand five hundred coins, which is pretty good and uh, really for the quality like of speed, the speed that you're getting, and uh. So yeah, on to my left back. There wasn't really a great left back apart from the one I got. I got Jordi Alba, who uh, pl has now plays for Bra uh, br br plays for Brazil. No, he does not. He plays for Barcelona. That is what I was going to say. But uh, yeah, I got Jordi Alba. He's ninety pace and uh, left back, and uh, he's what he's the best one out of uh, the left backs that I could choose because. I don't think he was the quickest one, but he was the best one, and I I like him. He's pretty good. Um, yeah, I got him for 
16,000 coins, which is okay, really, probably a little bit too much, but because he's like 90 pace and got 81 dribbling, it's pretty good, really. Um, I'd recommend him, but it's up to you whether you like him or not, and if he fits into your team. Um, okay, so that's that's enough for him. Now, on to my midfielders. I'm playing a 4 on 2 on 2 formation, by the way, if you didn't realise already. Um, so, yeah, my centre defence midfielder, I got Ramirez. I don't think he's the fastest centre defence mid on the game that you can get. You can probably get fast ones that are like more centre midfielders, but I think Ramirez is like the main uh, centre defence mid that you can get. Um, so, yeah, 81 overall, Brazilian, plays for Chelsea. 88 pace, 82 dribbling, which is pretty good for the price you pay for him. I paid 11 grand for him, which is a really good price considering how good he is. And uh, I would recommend him if you if he fits into your team or whatever. But uh, yeah, me pref me preferably but there, there. Yeah, I like him. Yeah, that's just easier to say. Um, okay, so now on to my right mid. You probably know who I'm going to get for uh, my right mid. I got uh, Theo Walcott. So yeah, I got Theo Walcott, fastest right mid in the game. I think he, uh, I think he's the fastest player in the game overall. Anyway, um, <coughs> sorry, and uh, yeah, ninety six pace, eighty dribbling, and uh, he's just amazing. I think he's got like three star skill. I think yeah, three star skill, three star weak foot, which is pretty good really for a right mid. Um, He's just really quick getting up and down the wing. Uh, I'd recommend him because I got got him for only eight thousand five hundred coins, which is uh, like the amazing price for uh, the fastest right mid in the game. So yeah, I would recommend getting him. Um, now on to my left mid. Uh, he's a silver because uh, he I really like him. He's he's brilliant, and his name is Rojas. Rojas. Yeah, that's his name. And uh, he's a left mid. He is Mexican. Plays for San Luis in the Premier Division Mexican or whatever. So yeah, he is really good. He's 96 pace like uh, Walcott. Fastest left mid in the game. And uh, his stats don't really show how good he is. But he's not He's not really the scoring type. He's more of like a, a crosser. Which is what you expect from a left mid really. Whereas, like, Walcott, he tends to, like, cut in and, uh, like, dribble around players and stuff and score. Whereas, the, that Rojas, he uh, likes to cross them in and stuff. Which is good to have, like, a little bit of variation on either wing. Um, so, yeah, I got him for 8,200 coins, which is pretty good for uh, the left mid, uh, the, blah, 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 the quickest left mid in the game. Um so yeah, I would recommend getting him if you want to do this team or you're doing a Mexican team or whatever. He's really good. Uh, now getting more interesting, I guess who I got, guess who I got. Uh, yeah, so centre attacking mid, I got a Brazilian player and he now plays for PSG. Can you guess who it is yet? Can you tell who it is yet? Uh, yeah, I got Lucas Moura. He's four and a half thousand I got him for. 92 pace, 88 dribbling, 4 star skills, come on, come on, 4,500 coins, seriously, seriously, just get him, just have him on your bench or whatever, just get him, okay, yeah, so yeah, I'd recommend getting him, he's pretty good, he's like, amazing, Um. yeah, there's not much to say about him, it, it's all there, it's just, he's just amazing, okay, Okay, yeah, thought so. Uh, so on to my first striker. I got a, uh, quite a quick guy. Yeah, yeah, he's quite quick. He now plays for Levante UD in La Liga BBVA and is from Nigeria. I can guess, can you guess who it is? <laughs> I'm not going to do that again. Uh, so yeah, I got Obafemi Martins for three and a half that... Uh, yeah, 3,500 coins, which is really good, mate, because uh, 93 pace, 78 dribbling, 74 shots, um, doesn't really show uh, the quality of him, really. Yeah, I got him for 3,500, which is great. He's scored, like, I've played, like, 
I don't know, like 30 games with him and he scored like 20 or something. Which is pretty good for the price he paid for him for like 3500 But I think he does go for a little bit cheaper than that now. I think he might go for one and a half. Uh, which is good. I would highly recommend... He's got five star weak foot, which is good because like if... Whatever, whatever way he's running, you can score. Uh, pref- uh, on, on the odd occasion, you don't score with him. Which is sad. It's a sad moment. But uh, on to my last striker, I guess. Um, he is the quickest striker on the game. 94 pace. And uh, his name is Dominique Oduru. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's him. Yeah, he's from Ghana. Plays for Chicago Fire in the Major League Soccer League. Major League Soccer League, what? Um, but yeah. Three star skill, not great. Three star weak foot, okay, I guess. Um, but yeah, I got him for 7,000 coins, which is really good for the fastest striker in the game, I guess. Um, yeah. It, it says, I think you can get him for probably a bit cheaper now. But uh, yeah, he is really good. He's really good. I would recommend getting him. Because he, he, he's, I've played like, I don't know, I think it's like 18 games. Uh, maybe, maybe like 20 games and he scored like 25 or something. So he is really good. He's like he's like a poacher kind of. I think he's like 6 foot or something. So he can he can occasionally score headers but he doesn't really. But uh, yeah, he's really good. Like quick to get rebounds and stuff like that because he's 94 pace. Uh, quick acceleration and stuff like that. And uh yeah, I would recommend getting him. Um, so, yeah, that's it. Uh, I've got a few good players on the bench, like Wellington, uh, Dede, Felipe Santana, players like that. Um, I got a centre attack mid called Traore. He's another one of the quickest centre attack mids in the game. And, uh, yeah, so this this is one of my favourite team. Got favorite, why can't I speak? Why can't I speak, bro? But yeah, this is one of my favourite teams that I've ever got on FIFA. Just because it like it's so overpowered, it's unreal. Uh, I would recommend getting it pre- uh, because I, I like it. I played really well with it. And uh, scored loads of goals and stuff. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. Comment, tell me what you think about this team. And uh, subscribe to see more squad builders and other FIFA footage and content things. Uh, So yeah, thanks for watching and goodbye.